I mentioned, we all rushed over to the deputy press secretary. The, the press secretary, Ari Fleischer, was with President Bush uh, at the elementary school. So we all raced to get to Scott. Um, and he then turned around and made a few phone calls to people in uh, George W. Bush's immediate entourage to try to get us some, uh, kind of get us some answers. Um, I, I sent emails to every National Security Council person I knew. Um, and um, this is all after the, for after the first tower is hit. After the second tower was hit, things changed, uh, obviously, even more because um, we were trying to figure out um, you know, what exactly had happened. We watched Andy Card come into that classroom and whisper in uh, George W. Bush's ear, uh, apparently saying something like, America is under attack. There's a second plane has hit the second tower. America is under attack. Um, and so then, you know, we were watching for a response from the president. And we got several. I mean, there were a bunch of different statements made that day um, as he hopscotched his way back to, to Washington, D.C. via a couple of military bases. 